Welcome back and time for your sports brief. Paul Lomuria was crowned the overall winner of the Grand Nairobi bike race as over 1,500 cyclists turned up for the second edition of the race in Nairobi, which was sponsored by Jubilee Insurance. The diverse group of cyclists from across 20 countries traversed Nairobi in an event that sought to celebrate the cycling culture and advocate for wellness, social bonding, and environmental conservation. Here's NTV's Hilary Anakea with the highlights of the day. Paul Lomoya, who recently sat for his KCC examinations, brushed off the examination fatigue as he cycled to a resounding victory in the men's main race at the Jubilee Insurance Live Free 75 km race. The Ugandan cyclist based in Kaptagat, Kenya, was among a contingent of cyclists under the Ineos banner at the race. It has been uh, my prayer that uh, one day I'll be out of school and I'll be able to find myself racing the professional levels and um, yeah, I wish it's, that's something to start from today. Meanwhile, all Africa Games bronze medalist Nancy Debe Akinyi battled the morning rain to come in third in the women's main race. It was won by Dutch Barbara Kramer. It's only my second road race of the year. I raced uh, last on the road in February and then today. And then I think I'll race again on the road again in February. So I'd say t today it went way better than I expected. I didn't even expect to be in top 10. So yeah. It the race that boasted six categories, including the Black Mamba, Family Fun Ride, Kiddie Race, Individual Race, Veterans Race, and Paracycling Race. So Joyce Nyaruri win the ladies' Black Mamba category as Peter Kamau won the men's equivalent. Jubilee Insurance said the event, which hosted 1,500 cyclists, was geared towards celebrating the cycling sport and at the same time advocating for wellness, social bonding, physical activity and environmental conservation. It's a sport to, to get behind because it cuts across ages, cuts across classes, cuts across uh, geography um, and is spot on in terms of our other agendas around living free, health, mental wellness and um, to a certain extent um, uh, protection of the environment. Cycling is a fairly unconventional sport in Kenya. However, the huge number of cyclists here just shows how much sport has grown in Kenya, an indication that maybe in the near future, this will be one of the most competitive sports in the Kenyan sports industry. Hilary Anakia for NMG Sports, Nairobi. All right, now Nairobi Senator Edwin Sifuna is optimistic that City Stadium together with Dandora Stadium in Nairobi will soon be in good state.